What's up guys, I'm finally back from a really long week of work. So I'm going to keep this video nice and short. Um, the winners for last week's set giveaways, I've already contacted you in-game. Um, the only one that has not gotten back to me is, um, I think it was Sketch. No, I could be wrong. I, 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 have, I honestly can't remember who won this one. But I already added you in-game, so if you see this video, Check out your friend's request list, I'll, I'll be in there somewhere. Um, so next is for the Go giveaway. Um, first of all, the turnout wasn't too, too good. And most of, like, I think the first few questions were almost the same. So, um, it was really hard for me to decide a winner. Um, and I, honestly, I, I, I have not decided right now. So I'm just going to go through this and answer this as I see it. And I'll pick a winner on the spot. So first one is by my dear friend Cole. So why did you start this channel? Or what this uh made you decide to start creating videos? Okay, so this channel was the the goal was just to aim at people who are relatively new to the game. If you're not a hardcore D3 player like some of like I'm sure you've seen the other streams, you know, some of them are really they'll edit 8 hours a day or something like that um, if you're a little more like me who just plays like an hour or two a day and you know you want to get better faster and you don't know how to this is what this channel is kind of geared towards um, I, I, do, I did make an announcement video when I first opened up this channel kind of explaining this but you know it wasn't too it wasn't a really detailed explanation um, as for yeah, that, that's all for that, I guess. Um, so, congrats to the winner, JP. Do I have plans to make my own Twitch channel? If so, when? I personally think... Uh, well, it's nice for you to think that I'll gain popularity quickly. Uh, I don't think I'm too entertaining. But, we'll, we'll see, I guess. Um, so, I do already have a Twitch channel. Um, in my earlier videos, I used to link it. But, I have not been streaming. And the main reason is, it's just... It's a really complicated setup to stream and uh, I do not have a computer that's capable of streaming and playing uh, and I have to have my back I have to have music playing in the background because I can never play a game without music so I kind of need a better computer I have been talking to um, arguably the best customized gaming PC in my country right this is uh, I it's my sister's friend actually so I have been talking to him uh, I'm working up a budget but I just you know, I've been really busy working recently, so it's been impossible for me to go down and actually, you know, give him like, quota uh, get a quotation from him and whatnot. Uh, um, having said that, I do plan to start streaming hopefully by the end of next month, or at least the month after. So yeah, I'll, I'll keep. I will. I will post like a note here and there. Or, you know, have like a announcement video that I'll be streaming on on, on my channel. Though there are certain complications with streaming as well, being that my time zone is a little different. I am from a different part of the world from most of you, so uh, my time zone could be quite. It, it would be pretty awkward for most of you if you try to catch catch me streaming. Um, so I'm yourself. Oh, sorry. Yeah. So Sepomet has the exact same question. Um, I am yourself. Said uh, asks you know. Why did you start playing D3 and why did you make this channel? So I already explained why I made the channel. Uh, why I played D3 is actually, it's a pretty interesting story actually. Um, I got D3 fairly recently. If I'm not mistaken, it was December or January. And what was going on was... Um, I actually just broke up with my ex-girlfriend and I was like... Well, you know, I don't want to spend too much time thinking about it, so why don't I play a game that will just consume a lot of time? So I asked around, and my friend just goes, well, Diablo 3 kind of, it's kind of a long game if you really, like, farm all the time. So I was like, okay, why not? Then, there you go. I've been playing D3 ever since. So that's that. So technically, you could say I played D3 because of the goal. Um, Delic. Lem asks, 
Uh, what future do you see in D3 or gaming? Well, in gaming in general, I, I don't really have too much of an opinion because I don't play too many games. Um, uh, but for D3, you know, I play a little bit, I, I kind of know. Um, so, we all know, or at least it's been it's been stated that, that, that they will be making an expansion. So, um, I guess that's what we have to look forward to, I guess. Um, there are some things that I would like to see added and removed from the game, but I'm not sure. You know, I know I'm not in any uh, position to say what 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 is what should be done and what shouldn't be done. I guess. Um, so I guess the only thing we have to look forward to is the expansion. I am hoping that they do add things like mystics and um, gear customization, but again, I'm not in any position to say anything. Uh, for gaming, I, I do hope that esports grows so just a little bit more. I, I, I am a huge fan, you know. I do watch like things like the GSL and our Pro League for StarCraft and whatnot. Um, I do follow the WCGs as well. Uh, SMN they come out. Uh, but I don't really have too much time for that anymore. You know, I am really busy working. Um, yeah, so that's that. Go up a little. It's from uh, De Davids1414. Um, favorite D three character and why? Um, honestly, I have no idea. I, I kind of like all the characters, uh, except for the Demon Hunter. I I I I might get a little flag for that, but yeah, I I I'm, I'm just not good at Demon Hunter, so I don't really like it. Um, for now, I would say it's just the Wizard, just because I played it the most, uh, and I never get bored of playing Wizard. Like I've gotten bored of playing Demon Hunter and Witch Doctor somewhat. Uh, I just don't think they are too interesting. Um, but then again, again, I could be biased because I, I play wizard, so that's probably just my favorite. Um, so that's me asking for people, blah blah blah. Um, which character class from D two would you like to, uh, would you like most to see, uh, ported or remade? Um. Honestly, I would like to see all of them remade, except for well, then you see the barbarian and uh, sorceress, is, which is basically the wizard. Um, uh, not so much Amazon. I I do, I would like to see a necromancer. And um, maybe a druid, but I would like to see druid look a little more like an elf kind of character. So it, we have like another range of at least a proper range bow and arrow kind of range character. Um, I think that would be pretty interesting, but again, that's that's just me. I have, I'm, I may not know what I'm saying because I never really played the other Diablos. I played them briefly, but I was like so much younger then, so games like that just bored me to death. Um, let's see. I think we're reaching the end. Yeah. Okay. So I hope you can win. Don't know. See, not interesting. Um. So Dragon asks, uh, <laughs> where are you from, it? What do you do for a living? Okay, um, I see he was talking to Dragon because he won the uh, Witch Doctor, no, the Demon Hunt set. So I, I told him, you know, it would be hard for me to stream and whatnot. Um, so where am I from? I'm from Singapore. That's in Southeast Asia. It would be pretty hard to find on the map being that it's arguably one of the smallest countries out there. Like, it's, it's really hard to find. All you need to know is it's Southeast Asia, it's tiny. Um, nothing else too much to say about it. We have a great nightlife here though. Like I've been around, I, I've traveled quite a bit. And I think Singapore is one of the better night, uh, nightlifes out there. And the crime is pretty low, so you don't necessarily have to walk out worrying about being stabbed or anything like that. And uh, what do I do for a living? I am actually the owner of four different companies. Right. Um, not too long ago, I was in the army because in Singapore it's a must to serve for two years in the army. So I just got out of my service, my two-year service, and now I'm back to running my own businesses. Um, what kind of businesses do I run? I actually do uh, interior design and home automation, which is kind of like uh, using your phones to switch on and off the light and whatnot. So yeah, that's that. Um, I guess the more interesting questions would win for this giveaway so um, I'm gonna give it to TYJ here so you'll be winning 
um, the first place I guess so you get 30 mil so if you ever see me online I, I'm pretty sure I've added you in game already so if you see me online do um, add me up I'm yourself I think you got third place and um, where is that other guy? Um, what was his name? Here, Centric. You want second place. Now I I do just so that you guys know you know I do see things like oh I hope I can win the wish of this hat. I do I do see this, and it, you know on one hand I do feel bad that I don't always give people who ask this nice like ask for the sets. I don't always give it to them, but. Uh, I, I feel that I'm pretty fair in how I decide. I do ask for your battle tags, so I do check up your profiles and see um, you know, whose gear needs the most work, you know, who's new, and I, I tend to give it to them instead. Um, having said that, um, most of my videos give you a rough guideline of how I build sets. Um, personally, with the bigger budgets, I'm not too good. I have a lot of survivability, but not a lot of damage. So, um, I don't know, I don't I wouldn't build really structure a fifty mil set the way I structure them, but it's a nice place to start if you like I never die on a high MP with my fifty mil sets unless it's laggy. Uh having said that, um I will be releasing low budget guides probably starting today, so that might be one out right after this. Um and my and my like low budget guides I think are the best out there. Um, and I'm talking like really low budget, like 1 mil to 5 mil kind of low budget. Um, 20 mil, I haven't seen too many good sets. Um, Ziz does have quite a bit of uh, guides out there. Um, he's probably the only one that does like 20 mil budgets. I, I have not seen too many 20 mil budgets. Um, but theirs are pretty good. I am a huge fan of their sets. Um, and I think 50 mil, you know, just follow Archon. Archon seems to know what he's doing, you know. I've never seen sets turn out quite as well as his. Um, as his, so, like, he gets a lot of damage and extremely good survivability of his gear. Um, probably because he does a lot of research on the market for uh, about that range uh, in comparison to me. So he has a lot of really good guides. Well, at least he, well, he has like three or four guides out there, and they're they're pretty solid, especially the fifty mil ones. Um, I think my wizard fifty mil CM wizard turned out just slightly better than his in terms of survivability and uh, damage, but you know, I think overall he finds better deals than I do. Like he knows how to play the market a little better than me. So yeah, that's that. Um. Um, just so that you know, uh, everyone that left a comment here, you know, I decided to just give you all like a million gold each, since you know there's practically none of you here. So I'm just gonna add all of you here, um, right now, and um, I'll pass you the gold. So that's that. Um, for the future of the channel, you know, things will have to slow down quite a bit. Like I may not be able to push out like three, four videos a day, kind of like I did last or uh, a week, like I did last uh, the previous few weeks. Um, I just don't have time for that anymore. But uh, yeah, as you can see, I do try to make the time. Uh, I do give myself Sundays off. Only Sundays. I work six days a week. Though I might make it seven, depending on whether I'm, I have a project on or not. Um, obviously, if uh, my business turns out well, I will be spending just a little bit more time on my own personal business and less on this channel. But when I do spend time on the channel, I will have a little bit more money to spend. I'll buy, I'll just buy gold and, um, you know, buy out be better items. Um, so for this month, um, I'm done with the really big uh, gold budget giveaways. Like I said, I'll be doing the smaller budget sets. Um, one million gold I'm not going to give away unless you guys really want it. Um, you can leave a comment in this video telling me if you want it or not. Um, but I think in most cases, most of you would have a million gold fairly easily. Like once you hit sixty, uh, level sixty, you should have about a million gold, unless you spend all your gold buying items all the time. Um, so yeah, I'm not gonna give away the one million gold sets. The five million ones I might consider. Um, but I'm not gonna do too many giveaways from now on. I'll just be doing. I'll 
I will alternate between um, something like a 100 mil set giveaway or 50 mil set giveaway or a 10 mil set giveaway and um, a weekly uh, or rather a monthly legendary item giveaway so I will be going on the off chat market and uh, sniping some good deals and uh, I just give, give them away to anybody uh, who subscribed and leaves a comment so that's that guys um, thank you guys again so much for the support and um, yeah that's that I'll see you guys next time JP signing out